Hey besties, Janaya aka Big Naya here back with another video. As y'all saw the title of this video, this is going to be like a collective vlog, I guess you call it. I really don't know what I'm titling it, but just know I'm going to do like a little 48, 72 hours day in my life as I'm getting myself together for this upcoming month. It is April 29th. It is 2.02 right now. I have a nail appointment at 3 p.m. because... I'm still rocking my birthday nails from March. So I literally had these nails for a whole month. Okay, book with the tech for real in Dallas, Texas. Cause okay, the nails is still nailing. I went ahead and did my hair real fast. I do get my hair done tomorrow. I'm getting some braids. But the reason why I did my hair is because baby before i get my hair done i need to complete the rest of these wig videos so i can get my money on okay i need my money on and plus i'm getting braids so when will i have any other time to put the wig on so i went ahead and you know put this wig on and then when i get back home i am going to film a fit video i was supposed to have a lash appointment at 12 p.m but the lash tech canceled on me i was a little upset but you know something serious happened to her and you know that matters more than doing some lashes so and plus she's sending me my deposit back she hasn't sent it back to me um she has to refund it through like the processing thing that i used for her booking so hopefully i get that back but I will say if I don't get that back then it's going to be a problem because baby deposit was $30 and I had a book with a new a different lash tech and that deposit was $30 so so far I've spent $60 for some lashes and I don't even got my lashes done but hey yeah I definitely do need my lashes done it's like I mean not my lashes I definitely do need my eyebrows done because it's like when you get this that, and the third this that, and everything else done then you gotta get every the rest of the stuff done you know what i'm saying the only thing i'm not getting done with this maintenance is a wax because baby ain't no hair down there and it's been a month almost yeah it's been like a month and ain't no hair down there i'm super excited i'm gonna be looking like a bad girl your girl been out here been treated like dog crap so you know i gotta stunt I ain't gonna say I got a stunt for the next person, but I definitely gotta get myself back together and just feel like that. Mm. So, mm. and I low key, I wouldn't say I wish I wasn't getting my hair done, but this wig is so cute. And I've never had like my hair this short before. So, yeah, I'm gonna have to. Okay. I am dressed, about to head to my nail appointment. It is 2.41 right now. She does not live that far from me, but your girl needs to start being on time to her appointments. So I am going to be leaving soon in like the next five minutes. But let me go ahead and show y'all the fit. Okay, so I got on some Gucci sandals from the H Gate. I got on these sweats. And then I got on this just white long sleeve shirt. So yeah, the fit is pretty simple and cute. It's so hot outside, y'all. It's like 80 some degrees. But I got a long sleeve shirt on cause I'm going to be inside her house and who knows if she got it hot in her house or cold in her house. Um, but me personally, I am anorexic. <laughs> no. anemic <laughs> please don't please don't cancel me for saying that i am anemic y'all so i get cold like easy so i need to have a long sleeve shirt on because you know again who knows if it's cold in her house so i just got to be prepared but i'm about to fix my hair on this side because it looks like it got some like 
dents in it or something. So when I get to my lash appointment, ugh, baby, no, because my lash stick canceled on me. When I get to my nail appointment, y'all will see that. Let's go ahead and get into the nails though. Hey bestie, so I'm going to give y'all a better look at my nails and everything when I get out of the shower from washing my hair. It is 9.41 right now, so I really need to be done with like washing my hair and kind of like blow drying my hair no later than 10.30. So this is what my hair is looking like. Your girl had to film a fit video, which I completed that. I was kind of bull BSing. When I got finished with my nail appointment, I got finished with my nail appointment around like on close to six o'clock, like five thirty, and then I got home like close to six, and I had to take me a nap because your girl had a mean headache, and then I didn't get started with fit video until like eight thirty, nine o'clock. So now you know, like I said, it's nine forty one. So let me go ahead and just get to washing my hair because my hair appointment is tomorrow at 9 a.m. I got to get it together. I think I told you guys 10, but I changed it to 9. So I got to get, get this hair together. Let's go ahead and do that. Besties, I just finished blow drying and washing my hair. It is 1037 right now. So I'm really going to go ahead and lay my butt down. Oh, I'm so sorry, Lux. <laughs> I ended up getting me a new tripod. Uh, I ended up getting me the white wireless one, the Sony one. I had the black one and I lost it. I wouldn't even say I lost it. I actually know where it's at, but where I left it at, they saying they can't find it. But I ended up getting a used one. So I'm gonna set it up for it to be used. It looks pretty freaking brand new. And I actually like that I got it in white this time because I had it in black, but my Sony camera is white. So like everything gotta match, you know what I'm saying? But I am gonna stop rambling and get to going to bed because a sis kind of got a very productive day tomorrow. I've been having a pretty much productive day all this week so far so i'm pretty freaking excited for tomorrow to get my hair done because i'm so tired of the wigs i'm literally so tired i will talk to y'all in the morning don't wait up for me too much now but good morning besties good morning cousins good morning brothers and sisters i am awake on this beautiful tuesday it is 8 06 right now when i tell y'all i've been up for quite some time I've been up for quite some time before i even get like into anything let me show y'all my nails so they're just black super cute i don't know why i was feeling very black vibes but yeah and i got black french tip on my toes so far this morning i have made my breakfast y'all in the breakfast sandwich is falling apart it's giving big back lux when i tell y'all i put peanut butter and jelly which probably isn't a good idea but your girl is trying to eat good so i gotta intake a lot of food so i got two sandwiches eggs with cheese peanut butter and jelly turkey bacon and um syrup <laughs> okay mind y'all hmm. i stick mind y'all i'm eating this on whole grain bread not no regular white bread whole grain wheat bread do need like some more syrup but other than that it's really good i don't know how i if i can finish both 
but we gonna try because your girl needs to eat okay uh, i am going in my sandwiches my hair appointment is at nine o'clock i'm gonna have to get up and leave for that soon at like 8 30 because your girl got to make it on time and i got 20 minutes so i'm really gonna throw my outfit on so i got too much to worry about um i attempted to do my edges early this morning but baby they uh yeah I, I was gonna i said i was gonna redo them i don't think i got time for that so it's okay but let me just finish eating my sandwich just a little feet check of what i'm wearing to get my hair done i gotta put like my ring as a necklace on but this is the fit check let's go ahead and get into the hair i fixed my edges up and Six and a half hours later. It is 9.19. And tell me why she's got me waiting out here, y'all. Let me stop lying. Because, mind y'all, my fault. Like, my fault for real. I've been losing track of time. Time been, like, speeding at the pace so fast. Let me just say that. We set my appointment for next Tuesday may 7th not this tuesday april 30th but is this gonna get me in later tonight like thank you so much because i took my hair down uh i done got my nails like i done got everything together thinking i'm finna get my hair done i get my lashes done on thursday like a girl's just gonna get put together and i don't get my hair done too well it was going to be next tuesday like no so Thank you so much that she can get my get me in today, just at a later time. That time is 7.30, and I will end up going to get my tattoo done earlier than what it was going to be. So, I was going to get my tattoo. I'm going to still do my tattoo at the same time, actually. So, yeah. Or I may actually come earlier today. So, just by the time he finished, it don't have to be like traffic time and all that bull crap. So, I'll probably tell him, let me be on the way in like the next hour or so. Yeah, but whatever goes on next, you guys will see. Um, I do know for a fact I need to get my eyebrows and my upper lip threaded. But I put like this eyebrow like gel on my eyebrows so they like real stiff so i don't know how i feel about getting my eyebrows threaded i got like product on my eyebrows so <sighs> you'll probably just say that for tomorrow and yeah hey besties so it is 12.08 right now i took me like a two hour power nap so right now i am up and I'm stuck. No, I'm just kidding. But I'm up. And, um, I better head to my tattoo appointment. Uh, I'm gonna get there around like 12 30, I wanna say. Probably something like that. But, yeah, I'm gonna head there. Let's go ahead and get started with this tattoo. I am using number cream, so I do wanna let y'all know this now. If y'all decide to book my tattoo man and y'all want numbing cream, buy the numbing cream yourself off of Amazon because if you buy the numbing cream through him, baby, or through the tattoo shop, they're going to charge $4. Hell no. Nah. Uh, numbing cream is not even that much on Amazon and it's going to work just the same. So, yeah, I just want to give that a heads up because the work is great. You know what I'm saying? Y'all going to see it and be like, I'm going to book with them if you're in Dallas, Texas. But, yeah, I just know that. I was still, like, sleep talking, but we up. And let's go ahead and get started with this tattoo.
Let's just say the numbing cream did not work. <laughs> Zero out of ten. Do not recommend. I have officially made it home and all honesty I cannot remember if I showed you guys the finished look of my tattoo but it is wrapped right now so yeah but just know it's spa tombs that ink did his thing so definitely looks definitely go book with him for sure i am about to make me my dinner because my hair point is at 7 30 right now it is 4 52 and i you know gotta start making home cooked meals eating home cooked meals so i'm gonna make me some turkey burgers i don't even know what you want to call them but you know how you would make your burger patties out of beef i'm using turkey y'all know i got like a meal prep type of thing with a fitness trainer and all so really i'm supposed to be eating turkey over beef now so i'm basically be eating some turkey burgers and um, i'm trying to make some like french fries i literally will have to make the french fries from scratch though <laughs> so i'm gonna have to peel the potato cut the potato everything like that so that'll be interesting but i'm not too comfortable right now with doing like cooking with y'all because baby just know i ain't too comfortable with it right now let me practice some more before i put myself in front of the camera in front of y'all and do that i am needing to put my glasses on y'all because tell me why i was at my tattoo appointment and i don't know if y'all can tell but like my eye looks super puffy right here and miracle y'all know miracle she said it's pos it's a star or possibly a star something like that and I went looking on TikTok and it's a sty and it hurts. So when I got home, I uh, did like a warm compress on it. And literally, I literally know how it happened. And it was very freaking noticeable. It's probably not noticeable to y'all, but it's noticeable to me. So I got a lash appointment on Thursday, early in the morning, like 9 a.m. So hopefully i can get this sty to go away i honestly wouldn't even want to risk it so i'm probably just gonna have to reschedule it because this is just so crazy so yeah y'all say hello to y'all bestie lux he's he's too focused with me having my glasses on like he ain't never seen me with glasses on before but come on don't <gasps> he bad y'all he is so bad but let me just go ahead and get into making this food so i can be done in a timely manner and yeah I'm headed for nothing, no turn of the sun to from nothing, yeah. Made it through poverty, on our minority, you have a story. Hop on the jet on my property and fly away. Fly, fly, fly away, yeah. Call me a present, yeah. Straight out of the trenches, yeah, yeah. My niggas can't whip me, yeah. The riches, the riches, the riches, yeah. Rich niggas, I was on six, yeah. All these hoes. The brace is done. So go book yeah. with us, sister. The at Krista <laughs> and yeah, got a large knowledge on her, huh? It ain't long, uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Real long, don't play with them. It's day May 1st, 2024, and when I tell y'all, I am 
so excited to just see what this month has in store for me and all honestly this month for me is just all about dedication consistency literally standing on business and not playing with myself just because i won't say like the first four months of 2024 i'll play with myself but i did not you know really stand on business like how i should have so i am giving myself may and june to get myself back right and that goes out to y'all too as well i wish y'all the best of luck this month it's never too late to start something new or even to you know keep doing what you're doing and fulfilling what you want to fulfill if you feel stuck that is okay but feeling stuck literally gets you nowhere being scared literally gets you nowhere but stuck so if you're scared to start your content creating journey or if you're scared to you know go in the route of starting real estate or if you're scared to you know go jump off uh i'm not making sense but you know if you're scared to do anything y'all <laughs> All it does is bring fear and it makes you stuck and you're literally going to be in the same position that you were in before because starting, you know, for instance, if you was to start your content creating journey, what bad, what's the worst that could happen? You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I love y'all so much. Um, I just wanted to start this day off by telling you guys this and, you know, kind of speaking some words of affirmation words of wisdom because you can do it you will do it i know you can and um i do want to you know uh of course we have already picked up our phone and probably did a bit of scrolling on instagram or tiktok whatever but while you're watching this video i do just want to you know i guess give a prayer to god and um you know bow your heads close your eyes whatever you want to do i just want to go ahead and say that um thank you so much for giving me the strength today to get the things that i needed to get done thank you so much for giving me the strength and the energy to pick my camera up and make content for my cousins because in all honesty doing youtube is something that i very much enjoy i am on your timing i'm getting i'm ready to put my all into your hands god and see what you have in store for me because at the end of the day whatever dark tunnel that i am facing there will always be a light at the end so i'm ready to put all of my uh fear in your hands and i'm ready to remove all of the negativity that i have in my heart um what my words can't speak please just listen to my heart and know what i want and know what i need so with that being said uh going through your son jesus christ amen didn't say the ending right but yeah um amen to y'all i am uh, about to leave the house miracle you know one of my best friends she is having her brand photo shoot today so that's amazing many of comp many plenty accomplishments being reached within my friends and i love that for all of us so i am leaving right now um her uh photo shoot is at six it is 4 54 right now but i'm gonna leave the house um her brother came and got me so we're gonna leave probably go run a couple errands for her before six o'clock comes but we're gonna have to be at the photo shoot place by like 5 30 so you know time is kind of pushing um yeah but let's go ahead and just get into the next thing a pretty much very productive day today i am getting pretty started with this video late but hey i'm getting started with the video and that's all i can do and let's just go ahead and move forward with positivity and yeah what's up y'all so we at the decree shop right now give me a drink and some food it is 5 38 right now miracle uh my hair is stuck to my miracle um should be arriving to the photo shoot at like 5 45 i'm gonna have to give her a call see where she at but she told me she was gonna try to be there 15 minutes prior thank you to six o'clock but baby i need me a drink and some food oh y'all this look good 
What you thinking about getting? Shit, the strongest one they got? Not the strongest one. <laughs> y'all, I'm gonna have to put y'all down so I can take a look at the menu and we'll figure out what I'm gonna get. This sauce. See, so this is the strong, the sweet, and these are 50 50, which would be considered the medium. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Good. Yeah, perfect size for the perfect lady. My drink, I had got strawberry margarita and hypnotic. So I got like two sweets, one strong, cause baby. <laughs> and then I had got me some fried shrimp, a fried shrimp basket, and the fried shrimp basket is the shrimp with fries. Cause I am going to be hungry. I already know it, so I gotta take a taste of my drink. This boy, man, said. That mother did. <laughs> and they put an extra shot in that mug just because he got a uh, per professional size. I'm going to take a sip of my drink. I can tell that's going to hit. You can tell it's going to hit? I bet it will. Ooh, she filled this mug up to the top. <laughs> Mm. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. This is good. Food looks good us. as hell. I ain't gonna lie to you. They done took their time with this. Yeah, they definitely took their time. This one took like a cool 30, 40 minutes. Real it, was time. Long. it was not that long. <laughs> it was like 20 minutes. <laughs> Put some ketchup. Oh, is this ketchup? Okay. Take it, you don't eat tartar. I mean, um, what is that shit? Tartar sauce. No, this no. ain't tartar sauce. No, what, the, what? No, the food is good. We just made it to the uh, studio. We waiting on Miracle. She ran a little late, so. I got time to eat my food. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into this shoe, because big accomplishments to her. She's doing her thing. And exclusive in design, so period. Let me see. Oh, oh this is too big. Uh, this is my big? first time trying it on. Don't pin the back of it. Okay. Oh, you got your first one? Period. Y'all, oh, three said people just counting on me right now. One girl said I got staff at school for three hours. One girl said I'm at the hospital. We waiting on the doctor to tell us what's wrong. It's a family emergency. I think I was born yesterday. <laughs> That's the bullshit. This the same girl who friends. She was probably just trying to be nosy for her friend. Mm. We gonna make America. Y'all, we inside. They playing music though, so we gonna have to be quiet. Okay. I'm just a girl who loves pink. I love pink. <laughs> long time no speak it is saturday may 4th it's 12 52 right now your girl is about to leave to go to her lash appointment because i still don't got no lashes but i'm gonna have some lashes okay so before i even get to doing my lashes i'm gonna go ahead and go to the eyebrow place because i need to get my eyebrows threaded i need to get my upper lip threaded i'm sure she's gonna be trying to take videos and i'm not even gonna lie like once you start getting your upper lip threaded wax whatever it becomes very noticeable so i need to just go ahead and get that taken off i just wanted to go ahead and do like a quick little intro for y'all quick little update whatever y'all want to call it uh, before I get to moving around and I forget to do it. Let me show y'all my fit even though I look very like not put together. 
So I got on these metallic Tory Burch sandals, metallic Kurt Gale bag, uh, some blue sweats with a white long sleeve shirt. So yeah, the sweats are wrinkly, but it's okay. Anyways, so I'm gonna go ahead and go and I will just talk to y'all when I get to my destination. Okay y'all, so I made it to my destination. I didn't get my eyebrows done or nothing like how I was supposed to just because of the simple fact of like I was hungry so it was literally food or or eyebrows so I decided to get me some food I got me some Wendy's but I really could have got my lashes I mean my eyebrows and everything done because the last check uh, is 147 right now and she had me waiting while she was still working on somebody which is completely fine but damn I should definitely have got my eyebrows done but we finna get started so let's see what the lashes turn out like she doing a freestyle set so i really don't even know what they're gonna look like but i'm sure they're gonna look good you get what i'm saying every second every minute man i swear that she can get it say if you a bad bitch put your hands up high Hands up high, hands up high, tell them turn the lights down right now, put me in the mood, I'm talking about dark moon perfume, go, go. I recognize your fragrance, hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit, mm. and I know your taste is a little bit, mm, high maintenance, mm. 